to YouTube. I want to show you guys the generator transfer switch disconnect, whatever you guys want to call it, using the Blue Eddy AC200 Max and how it's work, how it works. If you do it quick enough, there's a little trick to it. Um, as you can see, I got a few lights on right now in the hallway, the kitchen, the microwave. You can see the the light on there as well. Let me see if I can zoom in and maybe, yeah, you can see it. So if you do this quick enough, if you, ch if you, uh, so the blue, the breaker with the blue tape is, uh, the kitchen hallway, living room breaker ran off the AC 200 max. If I flick this quick enough right now, it's running on the generator. If I flick it quick enough and go back on the grid, it's like uninterrupted. It's that quick. So check this out. So right now we're on generator. This is on the grid. And nothing changed and um, I tested this watching TV like the TV's on nothing happens it's that quick but let me show you when you go to the off like that it that it really is working so right now I'm gonna flick it on the off all the devices should be dead there's no power to anything and voila I'm gonna put it back on the generator well, let's check this out so right now, also the refrigerator is running. So you could see I got 146 watts. When I turn this on, it should bump up a little bit. So here is, sorry, here's the generator. Shoot, this popped up a little bit to 180. Let's go see. The hallway light should turn on automatically. The, the microwave is blinking and the kitchen light you gotta automatically you gotta go and manually turn it back on so yeah um that's how the ac 200 max is powering most of my house using the pro trans 2 generator transfer switch if you got any questions just ask me below and um got a link in the description for the ac 200 max for five percent off thanks bye